Yeah. And it's incredible because if you think about sensation, perception, feeling, thought, and behavior, actually the way to control our nervous system and feel the way we want to feel is to run that backwards. Behavior, thoughts. So if you change your behavior, then generally your thoughts, your feelings, and your perceptions change. Yeah. And everyone tries to come at it from the other end, but he's figured out through whatever process led him there and incredible life circumstances, how to run it in this direction of behavior first. Yeah. And I really think that if neuroscience has anything to offer, it's some understanding of what the underlying chemicals and neural circuits are, but the sooner that the human animal, the human species can start to understand that our, our feelings and our thoughts and our memories and our, all that is very complicated, but that when behaviors are very concrete and they are the, the control panel for the rest of it. It's behavior first, thoughts, feelings, and perceptions follow. Mood follows action. Mood follows 